Hey guys, um, so at some point I think I'm going to be able to stop talking about the Ghost in the Shell live action film. Uh, but we just got some new information which I think is pretty significant and I wanted to share and I'm not entirely certain what to think about it. Um, but here we go. So, uh, Sam Yoshiba, the director of the International Business Division at Kodansha, doesn't have a problem with Scarlett Johansson as Major Kusanagi. Um, Kodansha is the publisher of Ghost in the Shell and I guess, I'm not sure how it works in Japan, but I'm assuming that as the publishers of the original manga, they hold the rights to um, license it for anime and toys and this live action movie that's coming out. So they're kind of the custodians of the property. And he says, and I quote, looking at her career so far, I think Scarlett Johansson is well cast. She has the cyberpunk feel and we never imagined it would be a Japanese actress in the first place. So I just, I don't know what to do with that. I mean, that still doesn't excuse Paramount doing their um, CG test to yellowfy one of their actors. They, they say that they did the test on a background actor and Scarlett Johansson was not involved. But why the fuck would you bother with the background actor if, yeah, it just, it sounds like spin, whatever, fuck it. It doesn't excuse that. But if the custodians of the property think that she's a good fit, I mean, I guess, I don't know. I, I, guess, I guess the rest of us should think it's a good fit. I don't know. I don't fucking know. I don't know. I, I still think it, it, sit, it doesn't sit well with me. I don't, I don't like it. But I'm not sure what to do with this information. I, I don't know what to do. Like, um... Japanese fans don't seem to mind Scarlett Johansson. Well, ha some of them do, but a, a good majority of them don't. Um, so I don't know. Whatever, whatever my opinion is, or whatever anyone else's opinion is, it doesn't seem like it's gonna to prevent this movie from going forward. So we're just gonna have to wait and see what happens, I guess. Um, but yeah, I that's a head scratcher. Like, if if the if the publisher of the thing doesn't mind the way their their movie adaptation is cast like does that does that mean the rest of us should calm the fuck down and move on with our lives i guess i mean it's not gonna we can't stop it and clearly they have the support of of the publisher we haven't heard from shiro i don't think we'll hear from shiro from what i understand he's pretty reclusive Shiro is a pen name anyway, so he's probably too busy drawing lemon tits to care about this controversy. He's probably just going to cash a check and move on with his life. So, I don't know, man. I, I, I just, I don't know. <laughs> That's all I got to say. I haven't figured this out yet. Uh, so, apparently, this channel is going to become Ghost in the Shell every day, all, all day. Uh, so, the, the next bit of information we get, I'll probably have something to say about it here. Um... Yeah, kind of confused, but uh, that's life, I guess. All right, see you later. Bye.